Here's head coach Matt Easter, the King Swim team, and coach, um, you guys are coming off another win over uh, uh, Lyco last weekend. But um, I kind of want to ask you about just the progression of this team this year. You know, you've been going at it since, you know, what, September now, and uh, it's we're into January. And, you know, what have you seen out of both teams that you've just been really excited about as you kind of approach championships uh, season? Um, I, I think, you know, first off, yeah, we had a great meet last week. Um, you know, uh, it was just a great opportunity to race. I know I say that a lot with our with our um, with our meets, but I think in the college, you know, dual meet season and things like that, getting up and being able to race every weekend, whether it's your best events or an off event, having the opportunity to race is just a, a key thing for for the progression of the season. Um, you know, I think uh, where we're at now from where we started at, obviously it's a big difference. You know, when we start off the season, we're trying to, some kids have taken off a bunch of months. Some kids have swum through the summer. Uh, we have a very young team. So getting younger swimmers acclimated to the team and, and progressing them through that, that route um, takes time. Um, it takes a few months to do that and get used to the training regimen that we do here that, that's different than what they maybe did in high school or club swimming. Um, so the progression, I think everybody at this point is is at a point where they, they are comfortable in what we do training wise. They are now used to what we do and you can see that difference in the way we train um, and, and are preparing ourselves either for dual meets or what we got going on in three weeks um, at the MAC championships. So um, I think our attitudes have changed, I think in terms of you know, uh, being more confident in the way we race and, the, and more confidence in the way we train, um, preparing ourselves to, to race at our highest levels. And that's what you want to see as the progression of the year goes on. It's, it's the beginning of the year, we're excited to get into that first meet. Everybody's, you know, pumped. And then you go through the grind of the fall, um, dual meet season training sessions, you know, so on and so forth. Um, and then now we're starting to get excited for, again, what's in three weeks and for Max and, and um, we do have two more dual meets coming up, which we'll get excited for um, to finish out the season. But um, I think three weeks right now is our, our main focus, and that's what we're, we are focused on. Everybody's getting excited to stop doing doubles, um, so we should be sending those soon. Um, so we'll get start getting more rest. Um, so that's kind of where our minds are at this point of the season, is just preparing ourselves for that and you know having fun at the end of the year and swimming fast. Um, you guys head up the hill this weekend to take on uh, Misericordia. It should be two pretty exciting uh, meets um, up there at Anderson uh, Center. And, you know, how do you use that uh, as just another tool as you prepare for Max? Yeah, I think this week and next week, you know, our two main local rivals. We try to end the season with both of those guys now the last couple of years uh, with Misericordia this weekend. And then we usually try to end the season with Wilkes. Um, it just gets us excited. I think more than anything, you know, I, I know I've talked about in previous uh, talks is just wins and losses are, we, we don't, we keep track of them, um, but they're not the most important thing to our season. I think um, we want to win, obviously that, that's always the goal, but um, we, we want to look at, you know, being up to the challenge of certain meets. And this weekend with Miz, it's a challenge. It'll be a challenge for both teams to, uh, to get on the winning side. It'll be a great meet. And I think going into Max, that's really gonna help us repair. Just like two weeks ago when we, were, when we raced Messiah, who had come off winning you know, conference championships the last couple of years and been in the main team. It was our first win over them in, in you know, almost 10 years. So um, you know, doing things like that. And, and if we can get up and we can race and, and compete with Misericordia, which is one of the top top teams on the women's side for sure. And then it should be a very close meet on the men's side as well. Um, you know, hopefully we get up and we're ready to do that. And, and we'll see what we do, whether we win or lose. I want us to be ready for that challenge. And, and I think we will be, and that'll help us prepare us for three weeks from now and, and uh, competing at a high level at that meet. So that's what we're looking for this weekend. Coach, we appreciate your time as always. Good luck this weekend at Misericordia, and we'll catch up with you next week. Thanks a lot.